status, not married. My sister Maureen has what we call a busy ball. Inside is a reward, peanuts in the shell. We give these to the bears all day long, and they mostly roll them on the ground to get the peanuts out. But he is a show bear. He's figured out a much faster way. He just hangs the ball over his mouth and the peanuts fall right in. We also have another male black bear by the name of Mishka. He drags the ball to the swimming pool, submerges it, and the peanuts float to the top. They've all got a different way of doing the exact same thing. They are quite like people. All right, young man. Could you hand that ball into Maureen? Yep, you hand it in, and then they'll head right over here to the scale, and we'll weigh him in. Everyone asks him, how much does that one weigh? Well, his job in life is to gain weight. Spring, summer, fall, eat as much as he can. Winter time, live on the fat tissue stored in his body. Last winter, right before he went to bed, at his heaviest, 506 pounds. Morning today. 487 pounds and growing. Last winter, he lost over 8 pounds. Now, let's get to the fun part. It's his turn for a ride in the swing chair. Hey, you fell from the chair backwards. Oh, now you're going to ride backwards? You know, come to think of it, he does everything backwards. But that's just the way he is. He's a clown. All he wants to do is make people laugh. And he's working as hard as he can. Oh, thank you. He appreciates it. Look at him smile. Nice smile. Maureen slows him down. He needs help getting out of the chair. Doesn't want help. He's a teenager. He knows it all already. Careful, don't slip and fall on your rat. Ankle. Now I'm going to take this barrel and place it over here. Open end up. He does not like barrels that are open end up. So the first thing he'll do is tumble it. That's right. Watch your bare feet. Very good. Now jump up on top. He made it, but just barely. Better get your cameras ready. We'll stand him up, all the crowd. It's a beautiful sight. He does it every show. Except this show. <laughs> what do you mean you want some applause? <laughs> what a showboat. A regular ham. Listen, clown, can't you stand up in this direction? I know they'd like to see it over here. I didn't think so. But he'd like more applause. <laughs> well, isn't he a handsome fella? I bet some of you would like to take him home with you, wouldn't you? It would be a long car ride home. Almost as long as the car ride home with those new pop guns you got. Quick game of Frisbee, here it comes. Good catch. He hands it back, and then he gets a little bit of money. That's how they play the game. Could you try that again, sir? You're right there in position. He says, sure, we'll do it again. There's a good catch. And you'll notice that after every stunt, he gets a reward. That's what the ice cream is for. We have to pay them to do the work. They're like people. They don't work for free. Now, could you carry that thing over here, please? You know, these two play Frisbee all the time. You should see them down at Hampton Beach. Down there in the sun and the sand. Him and his Speedo. Makes quite a sight. Now, he is the biggest basketball player we have, but he's not the best. He's supposed to stay in the chair and catch the ball twice. He says, send it to me, Maureen. All right, let's see what we get. Good catch. He hands it in, gets a little tasty, and let's see, will you do it again? He says, oh, that was easy money, I'll do that again. Very good. Now you'll notice that the ball is made of hard plastic. 
The reason is, every time we give him a real basketball, he deflates it. That was funnier last season. Unless you're a Patriots fan. Nailed it. Six feet, seven inches tall, grab that ball, and dunk it in the hoop. And there's a basket for Patrick Watson. How about you try that again? Instant replay in slow motion. Thank you. You know, he's never lost a game. He came close once, but he ate the ref. Now we're going to show you the most complex stunt he does. We take a bunch of props, set them up around the ring. He comes along, picks them up, makes a pile, and what are you doing? Uh, you're making a spectacle of yourself. You can't just sit there and bear it all, you know. He made that one up himself. He loves to sit there and count his little piggies. And he started doing that when he was a little fellow. Maureen saw him and has encouraged him ever since. All right, why don't you accompany Maureen across the ring like a gentleman? And here comes the best stuff he can do. He grabs that scooter, walks it out, puts a foot on, and away he goes. Now, there's something you don't see every day. And it's not every day you get to see something you don't see every day. He's still in charge. Hey! You just left the scene of an accident. Oh my goodness. Where did you get a driver's license? What's that? Massachusetts? Oh. The things they say in the rain. Maureen better wash his mouth out with ice cream. He could hurt someone's feelings like that. Is there anyone here from Massachusetts? Oh, well, we're glad you came, because you're our bread and butter. How about Rhode Island? Woo! Very good. Connecticut. Nicely done. Let's see, how about Maine? Outstanding. Vermont. They finally showed up. How about New Hampshire? Very good. Anywhere else? New York? Huh. Never heard of it. And no matter where you come from, we are glad you came here. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, what did you think of our friend Kevin Jawasa? Yeah.